login и do login node. Let's go to user working directory. Here I have example of one MPI job. To compile this MPI application, let's list available modules. We will load module with latest free and open source software. Module list shows that open API was loaded as well. Let's compile. Let's run locally on five CPU cores for test purpose. Unload all modules. We will use short partition. It has limit 10 minutes and has only two compute nodes. This is example of simplified Slurm job script. Only account, partition, how many compute nodes we need, how many CPU cores per node we will use. We will unload all modules to be safe. Load only one module and use a run command to run MPI application. We do not have any running jobs now. Let's start this uh, simplified job script. And it is already completed. By default, Slurm will create output file with job ID in the file name. But let's take a look on more realistic example. Here was added time limit for job memory limit, a job name, output file and email address where to send notification if job failed or was successfully completed. Let's run this job. Job is running. And we have output file. 